So I thought I'd show you the beginner, intermediate, and advanced way that you can go about using your cocktail shaker. First things first, ice is your friend, so don't be shy when you're adding ice to your shaker. For the beginners, this is a basic shake. If you're using a Boston two-piece, you want a flat side and an angled side, and you want the ice to do all of the work for you, so you want it to go from the top to the bottom with every shake. Whether you're going up or down or back to front, the ice is going to chill, dilute, and mix up your cocktail. Now for the intermediate, this is the double shake, two shakers at once. This one's all about your hand placement and your grip. I like to have my thumb on the bottom tin, two fingers on the top and two fingers on the bottom. If I feel like they're coming apart, I give them a little tap tap and I always shake away from my guest. And lastly, for my advanced, this is a technique called throwing or rolling. This technique is not as vigorous as a shake and it's not as delicate as a stir. It kind of lays somewhere in between. Throwing or rolling a drink introduces aeration and opens up all of the aromatics, giving it a much lighter texture. You'll often see people do this when making a Bloody Mary.